All right, so these are the name brand um, yellow jacket traps. And I'll go ahead and show you the box and everything that came in. This one's got five, at least five live, maybe six uh, yellow jackets in there. I think maybe they cannibalize each other before they die. I'm not sure. And we've got the 10 month uh, juice pack thing in there or whatever. They seem to work best when I hang them in the tree. And then I've got another tree with some other ones that still might be alive. They were earlier. There's like three of them there. And these do way better than the other ones. I'm going to show you the other ones and how they did and how they are doing. So let's go take a look at those. All right. So over here under our swamp cooler, which is where they all seem to find their water. There's other places they find water too. Um, we have the general $5. No, general's not the brand. We have the general $5 uh, Walmart yellow jacket trap. It's just a sticky trap. And this one's been under here for maybe less than a week, maybe a week. It's got one. Uh, actually, I'll be able to tell you how long it's been here. Uh, I see one yellow jacket. I think that's all. Whoops. And there it goes. The wire broke. I should just set it back up and wire it later. Yeah, I only see one yellow jacket on there. Unless there's like part of one or something. Um, that one's been out the same exact amount of time as the other one I just showed you. And the one back here. And like I said, I'll show you the ones that I tried competing with it and they, they didn't work. I think the one's called like BAM or Buzz or something. And we got them all, well, the first kind, the, the other one kind of got at the North 40. So this one's got three in it. It's under here under a tree. I tried sticking them right under like the swamp cooler and stuff, but they didn't go into it. So, um, yeah, I think there's three. No, there's four. There's four and there's one crawling up the side. But anyway, so that's that. Let me get a key for the garage if it's not locked. And I'll show you guys the... Uh, See if we can get in here. Show you guys the other traps that we got. See, I thought that the Walmart one, the five dollar one, was like an actual yellow jacket trap, not a sticky pad. But I, I kind of call it a little bit of false advertising. But okay, so here's here's the Walmart receipt for the original ones. And see, I don't know if it's focusing there, but basically these were purchased. On 529-2018, and that's about when I put this up or right after. This one here I put in that back, the one I just showed you. This was there um, in the back under that tree. And it caught, uh, it came in second place as far as how many yellow jackets it caught. Um, I don't see them. Any, there's one, two, two. I see two. I thought I saw five on here at one time, but I guess there's two. Okay, and so here's the other one. I'll see if I can find the labels here. This is the other one I got, the North 40, and they had all of them available. And this one caught one. And I just put the juice in it that came with it, and then there's juice up here, and you fill this with water, and you see I filled it with water, it all evaporated out. The top part comes up. I think this is called BAM or Buzz or something. And they're supposed to fly in there, and instead just spiders made webs over it eventually, and we only killed one. And it, the water stayed in here for a long time before it evaporated. So I put in the mixture that came with it that's supposed to go in there. So here we have... Um, oh, yeah, okay. So here's the Walmart branded ones. They're called uh, Trap Stick. Wasps, Mud Dubbers, Carpenter Bees. And they didn't seem to... They only caught, what, three so far? The two traps together. And that one, like I said, has been up a long time. And so the name brand ones we got are, there they go, the Yellow Jacket Trap Rescue Yellow Jacket Trap. And the bait that we're using in them is Yellow Jacket Attractant Cartridge from Rescue 10 Week Supply. That doesn't, isn't what comes with the, the traps. I've got the stock ones still in here that I don't know if they got the cotton ball and I don't know how long they last. And I'm sorry 
I can't remember exactly the name of this one. I thought it was BAM or something. I don't see any label on it. They don't seem to put labels on these traps. But So this one was the worst. This one comes in second place. And the rescue ones work the best. So, anyways, thanks so much for watching the video. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And just bless you. Please click the links in the description of the video. Consider giving to our Patreon. And go to ChristianCords.com. And all of the affiliate links and all that great stuff. All right. Hello everyone, we interrupt your broadcast to bring you Subscriber Bunny, reminding you to subscribe to YouTube and give to our Patreon and all of that wonderful, great stuff. Now back to your regularly scheduled video.